All right, I don't have time for eight rounds today. Really, I don't have time for eight rounds today, but we're gonna get in and get it done. It's going to be going back and forth from one side, grab that mat to the other side. We're gonna be doing side plank hip taps, really focusing on the side of the obliques as we're doing this. You can stagger your foot if you need to, hold yourself up, you can put your hand down, you can hold it to the side. Really wanna focus on the down and ups as we do these. Again, we'll do it for 30 seconds on one side, flip it over to the other side. Let's come on up, hold it up nice and tight. I don't want your bum on my knuckles. Come on down and up. Stagger, hold down with a little claw on the front. Do whatever you want to do. That's just what Gina was doing, holding down so you can really focus. If you're having a hard time with your balance, like that right there. That's what you want to do. I'll blame that one on the camera. Normally I don't. I can really focus on the side oblique and squeeze and still stay on the side. But do what you need to do. Come on, five more seconds on the side, and we're taking it to the other side. Down, grab that mat from underneath those Kit Kat's paws, flip it over, he's gonna be so confused. Get ready, come on up, and down, and up, again. Working through these, come on. Getting those nice side obliques, and make them, taper them in, make them nice and strong. All help support your back, your body. Have a strong core foundation, right? All right, so this will be two of eight done. All right, so put it over. The cat is right where my mat needs to go. I guess I'm gonna put it behind him. Hey, buddy. Up we come. He's like, I see a hand. Down and up. Hi. Come on. My feet are a little bit too far forward from where my body is. Where my arm is it is. I'm almost off the mat. <laughs> yes, he is the king. He gets whatever he wants. Okay, Google, resume straining. Let's keep on going, come on. Four, three, two, flip it. Arm out. Up we come. Ready for it. Go dance. Tighten that core. Come on, keep it tight. Ah, uh -uh, don't bite me. He says, you're not petting me. I'm going to bite you. So you better pet me or I will bite you. <laughs> All right, halfway, flip it over, two more each side, legs are up, coming on up, Just try to keep it straight, go for it, tight, tight that core, but squeeze it up, squeeze it all the way around, come on, squeeze it, have a nice tight core, working through these, make them count, Make your side of legs work. And flip it. Side. It's like right when I get comfortable next to you, you flip over. What is up with this? Come on. We have one more for each side after this one. That's it. These go by pretty quickly, huh? You know, I cut four of them off from what we've been doing, but still feeling it with these, that's for sure. Come on, squeeze it up. Oh, come on, cat. Not under my arm. I can't do it if you're there. You're in my way. Yeah, squish them. Flip it over. Up we go. All the way up. Uh, up the side. Focus though. Squeeze that core, come on. Four. 
three, two, one, flip it. Last one. Oh, we'll go. Hold it up. And go for it. Come on. Squeeze it. Body base is from the squeeze. Squeezing it really hard. And done. Figure out. Go for it. Hand opposite me. Twist. Forward. Hand opposite knee, twist. Ah, center. All right, rush through it. Had a really great cardio, full body. Um, not really, really full body, but it was cardio and legs with the St. Jude squats and everything too in there today. And this, I gotta rush and get ready now, but I still need to be able to check it off and get those done.